And welcome back to our town hall. You may have seen this post going around social media. It's gotten nearly 200,000 retweets. It reads for those wondering if it's worth impeaching President Trump this time. It means he loses his $2,000 plus pension for the rest of his life, loses his $1 million a year travel allowance, loses lifetime secret service detail and loses his ability to run again in 2024. Well, Franz emailed us at verify at WGRZ.com saying, I saw this post on Facebook and wonder if any of these statements are true. I remember hearing earlier that number four is not true, but could be added to the impeachment. Well, Lorenzo Hall with our Verify team has the answer for you. Our sources are the former President's Act, a Congressional Research Service report, American University history professor Alan Lickman, and Michigan State University law professor Brian Colt. Both our experts agree this tweet's wording is a bit off. Impeaching the president alone would not strip him of his benefits. He would have to be impeached and convicted by the Senate. And that comes from this law, the former President's Act, which entitles those who served as president to things like a pension, an office space, office staff, and money for travel and security. Here's the thing, a former president removed by impeachment would not qualify. In other words, if his term ends on the 20th at noon, he gets these benefits under current law. If he resigns, he gets them too. So if the Senate tried and convicted President Trump, he would not get a pension, travel fund, or other benefits. Our experts both agree he would still get security. Brian Colt points to another U.S. code, which grants it to all former presidents and spouses for life. Alan Lippman points to a recent amendment to the former President's Act that restored Secret Service protection. As for whether an impeached and convicted president could run next election cycle, Lippman says that's up to Congress. Actually, two votes that the Senate could take. One is conviction and the other is barring him from running for any uh, federal office, including the presidency. So we can verify impeachment alone would not strip President Trump of any of these benefits. He would also have to be convicted. Plus, he gets his security detail. With your Verify, I'm Lorenzo Hall. Yeah, Michael, I'm glad that we got to this one because I have seen it yeah. everywhere, particularly in the last couple of days. I've seen it all the time. I have, too, and I've seen people sharing it sort of from both political ideologies, um, making different points, and it turns out both sides were pretty wrong and missing a lot of context. Yeah, it's very interesting to see how, once again, it's you can't fit all the information in a tweet. Yeah, and a meme. Yeah, right. Ugh.